what's up guys and welcome back to my channel if you guys are new here make sure you guys subscribe right now don't forget to hit that notification bell because you do not want to miss a upload and also make sure you guys give this video a fat thumbs up so as you guys can already tell by the title today 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 I am gonna be doing a McDonald's car mukbang for you guys along with a story time so yeah, I'm gonna show you guys what I got to eat from McDonald's and then we're going to eat a little bit and then we'll jump into the story time. So the story time today that I'm gonna be telling you guys is my very first fight. Now, I haven't ever gotten to like a real, real fight except for this one fight and we're gonna go into all the details because I think that the fight is funny. Now that I look back on it, I'm just like, okay, yeah, this was pointless. Like this could have been avoided and you know, we just gonna make it juicy. We gonna get into it, okay? So I'm gonna scoot my chair up a little bit so you guys can see me and we're going to see what we have in this bag right here. McDonald's. So I have a filet fish um sandwich we have a fry we got two apple pies and we have a six piece nugget with sweet and sour sauce now i'm probably not going to eat all this food but i always like to order extra just in case because you never know and then right here i have a large sweet tea oh that is good baby okay actually I know it took a bite, but it's better late than never. So I'm going to say my prayers and then we're going to sanitize our hands. So, God is good, God is great. Thank you for our food today. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. So now let me get some. I carry sanitizer around my purse. I got some hand sanitizer. I'm going to put some on my hands. You got to stay clean. Oh, okay. Let's wipe our hands. And let's just jump into it. <clears throat> oh, that smell of sanitizer. Mmm. McDonald's fries, they have the best fries. For real. They have the best fries. I think so. Okay. So, my first very fight. I was in, I was in middle school. I don't know what grade I was in. I was in middle school and maybe about like, maybe like sixth or seventh grade. I don't remember, maybe like sixth grade. Maybe so long ago. Mm, I can't help it. I might even get finished, you guys. Let me take a bite of the fish real quick. People just staring at me, I hate that. Like, boo, damn. Where the cheese? Okay. Mmm, mm-hmm. That is good, mm. Funny thing is, I used to not like their fish fillets. I used to think that they was too fishy, but now, they're really good. Okay, let me see that here. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Lord, for McDonald's. Well, whoever created this, you are a genius. Mm-hmm. Okay. So, my very first bite. Like I said, I was in middle school. Maybe like eighth grade. I mean, sixth grade. And I don't remember what class I was in. Mm, I don't know, do we have Spanish inside middle school? I feel like it was a Spanish class, but I don't remember if we had Spanish or not. But basically, long story short, okay. I was in middle school, and I was in sixth grade, and it was dark time, and the teacher was like teaching something on a projector or whatever it was. And there was this boy, and me and this boy, we, we were already like friends, um and me and this boy were already friends but he was with that person where he would like like you ever met some people that like just mess with you non-stop and you, you tell them to stop and they're just so freaking childish and immature that was him 
So, back then, I don't know how he is now, but he was just childish. Like, he kept messing with me, and we were already friends, and I constantly kept telling him, like, stop, stop messing with me. You get on my nerves, stop messing with me. And what happened was, I don't know what he did or how he did it, but my finger, he pushed my finger back. Like, like one of my fingers got, like, bent back like this. And, like, how he did it, like, that shit hurt, you know, it came out of nowhere. He bit my finger back, and what I did, I got up and I pushed him. I'm like, you're not about to sit here and, first of all, get on my damn nerves, and I told you already to stop. And then he pushed my finger back, so I got up and I pushed him. And when I got up and pushed him, he pushed me back. I'm like, okay. So what happened was, we was rumbling under the tables, on top of chairs, all types of stuff. We was just like rumbling around. It wasn't like, you no, know, really like, fight, like, like punching fights or whatever. It was more so like, just like rumbling. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, I don't remember punches being thrown. And they made a bit, they maybe, like they made it, they may have been thrown. But I don't really, I don't remember all the details because it was so long ago. And I think I have short term memory loss. So, I do remember we was like, we ended up like when the teacher had got to us and all the other people had got to us, we was under a table. Okay. We was under the freaking table on top of chairs. Stuff was everywhere in the freaking classroom. And, um, yeah when they had got us they asked us what happened and i told them and i think we and we're or refer or whatever but i feel like this i don't care who you are if you are a male a female listen i don't care what you is okay i don't care if you're a freaking freaking alien if you put your hands on me i'm gonna hit you back i'm not gonna just sit here and allow somebody just to put their hands on me and expect me to just be like okay you know it's whatever just go ahead keep hitting me come on keep hitting me no i'm gonna hit you back so we have gotten a little tussle or whatever because he's got my nerves he pushed my finger back and i was like okay i'm not gonna sit here and let you do this shit no to me no more and so actually he got in more trouble than i got in i only got like a referral like a suspension like one day he got in more trouble than that i got in um i don't know if it's because he was a, a male but i've never gotten any other physical fight before not even with my sisters me and my sister never fought i was just always nice in school i was always nice to people nobody really messed with me so i never got into a physical fight now my sisters they've gotten in fights before but me personally i've never gone to a physical fight before and i hope i don't have to because i probably will lose i'm not gonna lie i don't know how to fight now i mean when somebody pisses me off i just go crazy and i black out and i just go crazy so whatever i do to you that's just what i do to you you know what i'm saying so i don't i don't know i never got in a fight before i feel like I was good in school. I was, I was like, I wouldn't say I was popular, but I was like more so of like, I, I, I just never, I never got anybody nerves. I never, now there are people who didn't like me. Of course, everybody has some people who don't like you, but if you didn't like me, that was your problem. That was on you. That's because you didn't like me. I didn't do nothing to you. People just didn't like me because maybe they nigga was looking at me or maybe i don't know shit i don't know why they didn't like me but that's the only part of the story time i can really tell y'all i don't remember nothing else i just remember me fighting with this boy and after that we actually became friends again like we, we were still cool we we're still friends um and we was either we was even friends in high school too I don't know for how long ago. I don't remember for how long. Cause a lot of people used to get my nerves in high school. High school years. I don't even know which one was the best year. I don't really remember. My senior year of high school, I only went. Uh, I only went to high school my senior year for uh, one class, and I think that was. Maybe English. I don't know. Probably my best year in high school. Probably probably my freshman year. I think everybody's like that. Comment on me on Instagram or Twitter or something. Let me know what was your best years in, in high school. Or if you're still in high school, how is your experience right now? Because I think mine was ninth grade. Because like, it's like fresh, you know? It's like, it's like fresh. You always like hyped up and stuff and you ready to go. And excuse me. 
yeah but I don't know so it's the only story time I have for you guys but I'm gonna continue eating because I'm still hungry whoa mmm my sandwich is gone there's this, this much left my fries you got this much left and I'm going to eat an apple pie now mm, about McDonald's apple pies I used to not like them and then I got pregnant with this pregnancy and now I can't stop eating them every time I go to McDonald's I'll be like hey can I have apple pie I actually David put me on apple pies It's so freaking good. But my jaws, do you guys' jaws ever hurt because you eat so much or chew so much? My jaws be hurting. Mm. Oh, shoot. Sure. I'm actually about to go get my toes done, you guys, because right now my toes is purple and my nails are like, you guys probably can't see, hold on. Let me show you my nails. There you go. My nails are like a, a ombre, white, and nude color. And my toes is purple, and baby, that don't match. So <laughs> I'm gonna go to the nail shop and get my toes done. Plus, I haven't got them done in like two weeks, so it's time for them to get done. I'm gonna probably just get white or something. <sighs> oh my gosh. McDonald's have one of the best sweet teas if if it is made right you guys if it is made right i'd be going to some mcdonald's and ask for a sweet tea and that stuff tastes unsweetened and i'd be getting mad because i don't drink my stuff before i leave the drive through i always leave and then eat when i get home or something so by the time i get home my food is ruined i'm like what the hell okay imagine what i'm saying here i just looked at my dashboard and i seen the song playing i'm about to play you guys a little snippet not a snippet but a little like thing of like one of my favorite songs right now i don't want to get copyrighted so i'm gonna just play a little bit let's see it's by um uh, janae Iko. i always say her name wrong and uh john legend i'm waiting for it to play wish it was do you have me under i'm going under Okay, yeah. I know I can't sing like her, but you know, this my stuff. When this come on, don't talk to me. I'm playing it all the way through. What in the hell? What kind of spell? I like that song a lot. If you guys haven't heard that song, it's called Lightning and Thunder by John Legend and Janae Aiko. I like that song. Actually, when I first, first heard it, I was like, uh. But then I started listening to it. I'm like, okay, I can feel, I can, I can feel with this. Okay. That's my last bite. A fish left. Mm. Okay. I'm still low-key hungry though. Maybe I can do like a um I'm gonna my phone. <sighs> Excuse me. Why. This is what that pie looked like. You guys. You guys didn't know. Like I said, I used to not like it, but they good now. Cause they don't have the cookies and stuff ever since the freaking coronavirus. They don't have the cookies and stuff right now or they don't have the salads. Mmm. Oh, it's warm too. It's still warm. Mm. Yes, ma'am. Mm, mm. I didn't even touch my six piece nugget, and I probably won't. It's hot. Another thing about the alpines, they're only good when they're fresh. If their apple pies are old and burnt and stuff, they're not good at all. Don't even, I don't even look at it. Mmm. Mmm-hmm. Oh 
Like one more bite. Maybe two. Maybe two. Mmm. <laughs> My jaws hurt. How <sighs> they need a break? All right. I ate three fourths of my fries, my fish plate sandwich, and an apple pie. I did good. I really need to cut back on my pop intake. That's why, like, when I go to McDonald's, I try and get, like, sweet tea or some. I need to drink more water. I've been drinking a lot of, like, soda, like, uh, Sprite, Coke. I drink a lot of pop. I know it ain't healthy for you, but it's just so good. You can't help yourself. That's one of my addictions, probably. Because I drink it every day, multiple times a day. All right, guys. That's going to be the end of this mukbang. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you give this video a fat thumbs up. Like I said in the beginning, don't forget to subscribe and also turn that notification bell on because you do not want to miss an upload. Uh, go on my Instagram at x underscore Bianca Reigns and go to my Twitter account. Um, I forget what it is, but it's going to be in the description down below. Uh, go to my Twitter as well and give me some different type of vid ideas that you guys would like to see from me. But until next time, this is going to be the end of the video. So I'll see you guys later. I am out. Bye.